Today we continue our entry into Jesus' passion, seeing Jesus with the disciples at the Last Supper. And the focus becomes at the end on Peter. Jesus is predicting his death and saying that the disciples cannot follow him in that, at least not now. He says they will follow later. But Peter, we love Peter because of his enthusiasm and his earnestness. He says, Lord, I will follow you. I will lay down my life for you. But Jesus says it's not his time. Jesus says you're going to fail before it's your time. We all kind of fail along the way to our time. Perhaps our time hasn't happened yet. But we also succeed as Peter did. But hopefully we arrive at a place that that first reading talks about. It says, it's not enough for you to be my servant. We're called to something greater. We're called to something more to go above and beyond. But maybe like Peter, not just now. But eventually, we will indeed be a light to the nations, as Peter was. We will indeed arrive at the maturity to enter into the passion in a complete and faithful way. And when that time comes, we pray to God that we will be ready then to follow Jesus. If we cannot follow him on his way to the passion now.